Welcome to the Shortwave Radio Channel and uh, for some of my favorite radios uh, in October 2024 uh, update. And this is in the playlist, by the way, so just look at the playlist, which is called September, October um, Best Radios or something. Um, the XH Data D109WB or for weather band. Now, there's two versions of this radio there's the D109 which is just a standard long wave, medium wave, short wave radio with FM. And there's the WB version, which adds the VHF weather band. So if you're in North America, Canada and USA, it's great because it adds the NOAA weather channels or the Environment Canada channels that you can listen to. So uh, this could be cool if you uh, do a lot of outdoor activities, see what type of weather is coming. So this is inexpensive. It's a radio that's, you know, priced pretty low. So it's like in the $20, $30 range. It is still pretty amazing. Uh, its biggest flaw, and this is where I'll put a little caveat, is if you live in an environment where there's a lot of medium wave AM stations that are strong and powerful around you, this radio will overload like crazy. And this is where it's not interesting. But if you live in more rural areas or areas where there's not a lot of medium wave around you uh, and so on. This radio suddenly becomes interesting. It's very sensitive. You will get a lot of shortwave stations. You can scan, of course, for the stations you want. It is a DSP-based receiver with a silicon integrated chip. Means, you know, it mutes when you tune. But overall, has great performance and is sensitive. Uh, so just be careful depending on the market you are. But I added to the list of some of the good radios for a simple reason, its price. And the price point is very low, and it has still good performance. It has the best audio of any little portable of this size that I've seen. Uh, the audio on this thing is just great, and that is also something to think about. Several bandwidths, of course, on shortwave and so on. Um, medium wave, long wave performance is okay. I mean, you know, it's, it's on par with some of the good radios out there. Um, and, of course, the weather band version is cool. If you don't need weather band, if you live in Europe or in the rest of the world, there's no weather band uh, for your country. So you can choose the D109 without the WB, which will be a little less expensive and be the same radio. It's pretty much the same radio inside. Uh, battery, it uses, of course, the famous 18650 batteries. So that is something to note. Uh, sensitive on telescopic, really, really amazing. Does have an external antenna jack, but I don't recommend using it necessarily. Depend depends on the antenna and where you're located. You can try it out, uh, but this radio easily um, overloads uh, on external antennas. But a lot of people are happy with it, and um, I think... Depending on where you live and where you are, this is definitely an interesting radio to get, uh, for sure. So uh, the XH Data D109 is one of those cool, inexpensive radios that you can buy out there uh, and uh, is available at XH Data website. Starting to get a, a, see, be available on Amazon and many other places also. So check it out if you're looking for something inexpensive, but that is good enough to receive signals. Uh, but just be wary of the overloading from medium wave stations. That could be a problem in certain markets. Here in Montreal, depending on where I use it, it, it is a problem. Uh, it's part of the fact that, you know, when you don't have, a, when you have a radio, actually, that's not very expensive. What, what do you do? You, you know, you play around with electronics to see what you can do for the price point. Sometimes it creates, um, you know, a radio that lacks and certain types of filtering and so on. But still, I think it's still worth to check out on the radios out there. XH Data D109 and D109 Weather Band. The difference, you see this little orange button here? This is the difference. The D109 does not have this. This is the button for the Weather Band. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.